kidney cancer or benign tumors or cysts on the kidneys. Robot-assisted partial nephrectomy is a recommended surgical procedure. This animation shows how the surgery was performed. The goal of this surgery is to remove the entire tumor. It also protects blood vessels and healthy tissues. After general anesthesia, the patient will lie on their side on the operating table. During general anesthesia, the patient doesn't feel any pain. After the patient is completely sedated, the doctor will do it in the abdomen. Three to five small incisions of a few centimeters. Surgical tools and miniature cameras go through these incisions. Insertion into the patient. The surgical tool is attached to the robot's arm. Controlled by the surgeon through the console. Now don't get me wrong. In fact, the robot itself. It's not automated. It's your surgeon remotely controlling it. Perform surgery. So why use robots instead of human hands? Because it allows for more controlled and precise surgery. Remote surgery can also be achieved. Let's talk about the process in detail first. Carbon dioxide gas is used to inflate the abdomen. Create a working space for surgery. After. Your doctor will take a preoperative diagnostic scan. Searching for tumors in the kidneys. When necessary, the doctor will assist the renal arteries to stop blood flow to the kidneys. So they reduce the bleeding when the tumor is removed. Then the doctor isolated the tumor from the kidney. Once the tumor is removed, before blood flow resumes, kidney incisions must be tightly stitched together. The removed tumor is put in a plastic bag and removed through one of the incisions and the surgical tools were removed. The incision was closed. Surgery completed. And in the time that followed, you may experience pain for one to two days. This is caused by carbon dioxide inflating the abdomen. Pain medication is required after surgery. And the patients are followed up for a while to see if the tumor has recurred. The surgery is performed within a few months. Most of the patient's kidney function will be restored. The surgery requires extensive experience with a trained surgeon, specific surgical indications and possible complications. Please follow your doctor's advice. Follow me, I'm Lao Yi of Urology. I will bring you more health science.